My name is Kate Griffiths from Whole Self Leadership and I've come on today because I want to talk to you about my forthcoming course, The Spiritual Principles Behind Colour, otherwise known as the Chakras course. We are going to be starting with the colour red, which is one of the reasons that I'm wearing red today. And perhaps to understand what this course is about, take a moment to consider how do you feel about red? What words or emotions do you associate with red? For me right now, I'm aware of the connection with all things physical. I've just spent a week with my family or my parents <clears throat> And I'm noticing that they are getting older. And what it reminded me of was the importance of keeping moving, of keeping physically fit. But there are other things that we're less aware of, and that is the importance of building our spiritual muscle. And we can't do that alone. And in a sense, this is what this course provides, a space to gather with like-hearted souls, to explore what colour means to you. So it's not gonna be me teaching you and it's this, this and this, although I will be sharing two sets of principles, the spiritual principles of colour as defined by the founder of the Colour Mirror System, Melissa Jolly, and also the business principles that I, along with my former business partner, created when we created our own set of colour bottles and wrote our book, Colourful Boardrooms. So there is a structure to the course, it's eight weeks. And what's different is that we're going to meet every other week to allow for more spaciousness, for time for you to absorb and integrate all that you've heard and explored as well as the opportunity to bathe in a colour bottle. So that we're working also, not just at an auditory level, but at an energetic level, which is where transformation really takes place. And really, this course is about connecting to consciousness, going deeper, going beyond the third dimensional reality of earning a living, putting bread on the table, looking after our loved ones, and actually really getting to the core of what life is about and building deep foundations for life and for business, because the two are inextricably intertwined. So that gives you a sense of what the course is about. And if you're ready, you can click on the link in the bio and buy it now. If you want to know more, I will be back with more information tomorrow. Or if you're still not sure, you want to reach out, connect, message me and we'll have a call to see if this is really what you need and are looking for right now. Thanks so much for watching. Bye for now. Hello and welcome. Welcome back to some of you. This is the second of my videos about my forthcoming course, The Spiritual Principles Behind Colour. So today I want to really focus on who it's for and doing that through the colour of green. And as you can see, I'm wearing green today. And you may just notice my little earring which is green and blue, which was bought for me, a pair, by my youngest daughter. So they are of particular sentimental value. The green is all about, I suppose, the space of being. It's the colour of the empath, the colour of balance and harmony. And I chose green as well because it's actually the complementary to red, which was the colour we talked about yesterday. So, 
who is this course for? And how does it relate to green? Because for me, part of what green is about, and I'd, be, I'd love to know how you, what you associate with green, is the coming together of community, coming together of like-hearted folk. And that's a, a really strong element of this course because it tends to attract colour therapists, um, other colour teachers, people who are maybe art therapists or using colour in their therapy in some form or other, coaches who are looking to expand and develop their practice, and senior leaders who are working in a range of different environments but get the importance of nurturing themselves which is an, also a part of green in order to be a compassionate leader to their teams so that gives you a sense of who it's for the sorts of people i attract into my world and depending on what i'm running I sometimes get a lot of men, but more often than not, quite a number of women. So this is a sense of what it is like. And in, in organisational terms or business terms, green is really about learning and development. And I think certainly all the, the coaches and mentors and people that I've really resonated with those with are those that really take their own development seriously have a curiosity want to learn so if that sounds like you then jump on in there's a link in the bio for you to find out more about the course and to join us if you want more information for feel free to reach out to me and let's have a conversation, 30 minutes, to see if this is for you. Anyway, go well for now. Hello and welcome. My name is Kate Griffiths from Whole Self Leadership. And if you've been watching this video series, you'll know this is the third of my videos, all about my forthcoming course, The Spiritual Principles Behind Colour. Today we're exploring how does it work? And that really is the sort of nuts and bolts, sort of like in organisational terms, what are the systems behind it all? Which is why I am wearing yellow, because yellow represents systems in organisations. And it's also representative of the mental and of our own power how we see ourselves, how authentic we're being, how much joy or fear we feel. Both of emotions are present in yellow. So that gives you a taste of the colour. So how what does the course work? Well, it's an eight week course, every two weeks. So we start on the 10th and then it's every other week after that to give you plenty of time to take in what you've learned. Each session will be recorded so that you have access to it whenever you want. So you can go back and listen to it if there's things that you wanted to capture or revisit. And I can guarantee you'll probably learn new things each time you do go back and look at the course. And whilst I'll be sharing each time the you know, spiritual principle that relates to life as um, created by Melissa Jolly, the founder of the Colour Mirror System. I'll also be helping you to build the foundations for a really strong and vital business because I'll be sharing the business principles that I created with my former business partner when we wrote our book colourful boardrooms based on the work we were doing with organisations. So in essence, you get two for the price of one. So I do like to add value. 
and there'll be plenty of space in the 90 minutes that we have together for you to share your own insights or ask questions to get greater clarity on a principle or an idea because we are in this together and we're learning together and you have the answers inside of you my role is merely to facilitate that and that's the whole idea in some ways this is a bit like a group coaching program where you get to participate and shape the outcome of each session so you'll get plenty of prompts and ideas and thoughts to make that totally possible so you feel really comfortable sharing and growing and I look forward to growing with you. So if you're ready, click on the link in the bio and sign up because I'd love to have you with us on this journey. A growing group, already half full and there's a maximum of eight places. And if you're not sure, do reach out to me either through leaving a question on the form on the website or by DMing me and we can have a call for 30 minutes to explore if this program's right for you. Go well and speak again soon. Hello and welcome. My name is Kate Griffiths from Whole Self Leadership and today I want to talk to you for one final time about my course that's coming up, The Spiritual Principles Behind Colour. Today's topic or theme is why should you join? And I've chosen to wear orange because in many ways I think this connects with the theme. Because we are all navigating our way through this thing called life with its ups and downs. And I believe and certainly it's my experience in the last eight years since I trained in colour, I found a way to make sense of it all. And I want to give you a taste of that and share some of those insights with you. Because we are not alone and connection is a vital part to whatever we do in our world and our life. And I can guarantee you'll for, feel that sense of connection if you join us. More specifically, there are probably three areas that people struggle with, that I work with, and that you may get some answers to. And it can all be seen, I guess, within the umbrella of this sense that there's something more to life, but you haven't quite cracked it yet. You're not really sure what that is. Maybe you want to take your work with clients to a deeper place or become a better leader. So the three roadblocks are, firstly, survival fears. So do you ever find yourself saying, oh, I haven't got the money to do that? Wondering if you can put bread on the table. That's sort of one level of existence and it's very real for people and yet that's not the truth of it at the second level it's more about emotional issues and challenges maybe unhealed trauma anything from an unmet need to full-on abuse and so healing that will allow you to be of greater service to those who you serve and at the third level, it's about our relationship with power, your relationship with it. How comfortable do you feel with it? Do you constantly give your power away? How authentic do you feel? And again, through the weeks of this course, you'll start to get some maybe different perspectives on all of these areas, which will help you to be a more authentic, more accessible leader, be that in-house or with your own clients. So those are the reasons 
that you might consider joining. And the bonus is you get to meet some wonderful, like-hearted people. And who knows where those relationships may go. Because after all, whether it's our relationship with ourself or with others, that forms the backbone of life. So I look forward to seeing you soon. And if you're ready to sign up, check out the link in the bio. Bye for now.